The current system for child care education is broken and it is crying for support. And we know that no one's coming to save us immediately. So Collaborative for Children has elected to be that entity that will go directly in, shoulder to shoulder, hand in hand with each child care center, making sure that it's high quality based on the metric of school ready children at the end of the day. Because we don't have universal child care right now, the child care industry in itself is fledgling. We have not adopted the technologies that are necessary, specifically in low-income community child care centers, to ensure that they have accurate record keeping, that they have real-time data to respond to, that they have organized systems and processes so that they can focus on the customer who's most meaningful in that center, the child. James Heckman is world-renowned for the contributions that he made and the way that he launched early childhood education on a national stage. He made an economic case for early childhood education as a critical part of the infrastructure of a community by saying that if you invest in every child, you get seven times at the minimum uh, of the return on that investment. It is not through a modicum of change that will ensure that there is equity in early childhood education and throughout the K through 12 journey, but it's a very disruptive and intentional change. Collaborative for Children is the great disruptor in early childhood education because we integrate technology in a way that other educational entities are perhaps afraid or reticent to do. We know that there are resources that will provide the information that we need for children. And Collaborative for Children doesn't hesitate to do anything that's necessary to support children's growth and prosperity. Because only 45% of the children in the greater Houston area are successful in the kindergarten readiness assessment, Collaborative for Children sees a need to step in at this moment in time and make sure that that number is much higher. We have a three-prong approach. We are supporting child care directors and owners with sound business practices. We are supporting teachers and caregivers with strong evidence-based instructional practices. And then also we are supporting the families to ensure that they are a part of their child's educational journey. Collaborative for Children is in partnership with the parent. They are given the skills, the age-appropriate training that they can provide their children at home, and a kit so that they can provide exciting resources to use as they wish at home. Also, Collaborative for Children is a great disruptor because we are using state-of-the-art technology in our centers of excellence, and we're preparing and equipping children with 21st century skills. The productivity of our workforce depends highly upon the experiences that we give a child when it's developing its neural synapses between ages birth through five. We are providing robots to allow children to experience coding and sequencing, things that they're gonna need in the near future. The worst case scenario is that we don't invest early in our labor force so that they have the skills to truly provide leadership for the greater Houston community and its growth and prosperity moving forward. The four competencies for Centers of Excellence staff, one, do they have responsive interactions and guidance with children? Number two, do they have strong instructional practices? Number three, do they create an environment conducive for learning? And then number four, how do they use observation and assessments to guide their instruction? The data is really important. How does a teacher use the data from those assessments to guide the instruction and to provide interventions for children? Collaborative for Children provides the additional support that is often neglected in the traditional child care center. This model is sustainable because of the kind of investment we do with the child care business owner. First thing we do is we do a what we call a business assessment for us to really understand the health of their center. Once that's completed, we create a business plan for them. And we work towards achieving some of the goals that we found in the assessment. They have a high turnover rate with staff. We work towards that. If they have a turnover rate of, of families, we guide our coaching towards those. If we see that they're not making a solid net profit, 
we work with them to try to figure out ways to increase that income. It's a great way for centers to reach long-term sustainability. Coming from a center myself as a director, what makes Collaborative really stand out is that they are providing professional development for teachers. In the child care space, teachers have a wide range of education. So Collaborative for Children is ensuring that we're building the competency of teachers to provide high quality education. The tangible benefits are that those teachers are not only invigorated because they are able to live their full potential as true educators, but they are also provided the curriculum, the resources, and the hand-holding that's necessary for them to ensure school readiness success of every child in their classroom. Early childhood education is going to be the backbone of our community's growth and prosperity into the future. And at Collaborative for Children, we're committed to that growth and prosperity of Houston. We believe that rather than waiting for large-scale policy change, that we are able to provide direct service in the most disruptive way with the use of technology, assisted early education. And we believe that we can scale this and that we'll be in high demand for other communities who need such support and that we will be ready to provide those resources to them as well. People open child care centers for the love of the community, for the love of the children, and they want the children to be ready for whenever they go to elementary school. For a lot of people, it's a job. It's a paycheck. What we do, it truly comes from here. We love that excitement of watching a center succeed.